When Rachel and Ross went on a break and Ross cheated on Rachel, it spawned the meme and excuse of saying, we were on a break. Although with some of these celebrity entanglements, as Jada Pinkett Smith likes to call them, saying you were on a break just won't cut it. An entanglement, by the way, is just a fancier way to say that you were cheating on your significant other. Welcome to the Top 10 Beyond the Screen. I'm your host, Johnny Rogers. And before we kick this video off, let us know down below which celebrity cheating scandal shocked you the most. Also, if you don't want to miss another daily video from us, make sure you tap that subscribe button and ring the notification bell. Plus, make sure you stay all the way until the end of this video because you won't believe our number one spot and I'm going to be reading out some of your comments, which is always fun. Now, with any further delay, let's get right into today's list, the top 10 celebrity entanglements. In at number 10, Jay-Z and Aaliyah. This celebrity entanglement is allegedly the reason that one of the biggest and most successful dynasty groups in hip-hop broke up. At the time that rapper Dame Dash was dating Aaliyah, little did he know that Jay-Z was also crazy in love. Dash and Aaliyah were together from the year 2000 up until she died in a plane crash in 2001 at the age of 22. While they weren't officially engaged, Dash previously stated that they had talked about getting married. Apparently though, Jay-Z had met Aaliyah in 1999 and the pair actually took a liking to each other. It was then rumored that they were dating after being seen together for several months. Although Dash just viewed Jay-Z as competition. Soon enough, he swooped in and won her over, thus ending his friendship with Jay-Z. In at number 9, Tristan Thompson and Jordan Woods. Chloe seems to be super forgiving when it comes to her partners cheating on her. I mean, she's already done it twice, and both times it did not work out well for her. First, there was her relationship with Lamar Odom that spawned a new Kardashian spinoff show, although all of that was cut short after news was leaked that Odom was struggling with some substance abuse issues. Then, when he cheated on her with Coco, she forgave him with hopes of reconciling the relationship, but ultimately Chloe filed for divorce in 2013. Next, there was Tristan Thompson, and even worse with this one was that Chloe really believed she had found a faithful man, although photos of him cheating began popping up everywhere while she was pregnant. She forgave him with the hopes that they would stay together to raise their daughter, that is, until she found out that family friend Jordan Woods was one of the people that he became entangled with. In an break, Kristen Stewart and Rupert Sanders. It was called The Kiss Heard Around the World. At the time, Kristen Stewart was in a long-time relationship with her Twilight co-star Robert Pattinson. Although while filming the movie Snow White and the Huntsman, she was spotted getting a little too cozy with the director Rupert Sanders. The voters were clearly snapped by a paparazzi that was like lurking in some bushes because the pair did not even notice. In regards to these photos surfacing, she said, I'm deeply sorry for the hurt and embarrassment I've caused to those close to me and everyone this has affected. This momentary indiscretion has jeopardized the most important thing in my life. The person I love and respect the most, Rob. I love him, I love him, I'm so sorry. Rob ended up forgiving Kristen because he didn't want to toss a three-year relationship for one infidelity, and who knows, she could have probably saved all of those words and just said that she was entangled with a director. Who knows? And at number seven, Swizz Beats and Alicia Keys. This is entanglement taken to a whole different level. Uh, producer Swizz Beats, whose real name is Kasim Dean, and pop goddess Alicia Keys actually met when they were teenagers, although Alicia admitted that she wasn't too fond of him at the time. While speaking with Us Magazine, she said, Honestly, I didn't really like him that much. I thought he was too ostentatious. Everything with him is really over the top. I used to see him and think, he is so annoying. Later on, Kasim ended up getting married to a singer named Ashonda, although while they were married, Alicia and Kasim started working together in the studio. Thus, the entanglement began and the pair got married in 2010 while Swizz was in the middle of a brutal divorce from Ashonda. The odd thing with this celebrity entanglement is that his ex-wife will come on vacation with them. Do the math on that one, that was weird. Not too long ago, Ashonda even posted a photo of her, Alicia, and the kids on vacation wishing her a happy Mother's Day. In at number six, Blake Shelton and Gwen Stefani. While country singers Blake Shelton and Miranda Lambert were still married, sparks began to fly between Blake and his co-star on The Voice, Gwen Stefani. Typically, the hosts of these kind of shows like this will display somewhat of a connection with each other to give the illusion that not all celebrities are friends. But with Gwen and Blake, it was different. To many, there was a visible connection on the show between them, even though they were supposed to be competing. That's the whole idea of the show. But the moment that Blake and Gwen Stefani got divorced from their respective partners, the two began dating, which means that there was definitely some celebrity entanglements happening while they were both married. Man, these celebrities are good at keeping secrets from the public. I'm sure Miranda was upset when it happened, but now she has also 
remarried, so hopefully the past is in the past. And apparently Blake and Gwen have also decided to tie the knot, but are just waiting for the pandemic to end. I didn't think that was a sentence I'd ever have to say, but here we are. In number five, Meg Ryan and Russell Crowe. Meg Ryan was married to actor Dennis Quaid when her affair with Russell Crowe became public. In 1999, as her marriage to Dennis Quaid began to hit a sort of a bit of a rough patch, she hooked up with her Proof of Life co-star Russell Crowe. The tabloids were brutal to her. She was painted as a cheater and the romance was just even so brief. So it was nuts that she got all this negative press for just such a small portion of romance. I mean, who knew that all she had to do was call it an entanglement and all would be okay. The celebrity cheating scandal led to Meg and Dennis getting divorced in 2001, which is something that Meg still discusses to this day. During an interview with the New York Times Magazine, Meg said, I felt the effect like I was the bad guy or whatever the story was, but I remember letting go of needing to correct anybody. Divorce is hard, love is hard, all those things were so personal and they weren't meant for mass consumption. Well said. In at number four, Kelsey Grammer and Katie Walsh. Kelsey Grammer's entanglements were a big mess and in his old age, I guess he kind of lost track of time. Kelsey accidentally slipped up and confessed that he had began an affair with his new wife, Katie Walsh, a full six months before splitting with Real Housewives of Beverly Hills star, Camille. The Frasier star spoke out on Jimmy Kimmel Live about how he met and fell for the British flight attendant that was serving him on a plane in December of 2009. Odd place to meet. He claimed that after meeting on the flight, they spent a magical night together in London. However, when people started doing the math, they realized, wait a minute, wasn't he still married at that time? This drama exploded when Camille took her marital problems to the set of The Real Housewives, which just made every detail become crazy public. During an interview with ABC News, Katie admitted that she was not proud of how the couple started out, but regardless, they've been married for nine years now. Past is the past. Just, just entanglements. In at number three, Kanye West and Kim Kardashian. When Kanye and Amber Rose were together, they appeared to be this massive, head-turning celebrity couple that seemed perfect for each other until the very end. An ending that Amber blamed on Kim Kardashian in a huge interview with Star Magazine. In the interview, she claimed Kim was one of the main reasons that she and Kanye split, and she even went as far as calling Kim a homewrecker. She also revealed that Kim had been cheating on then-boyfriend Reggie Bush with Kanye during the relationship, and even texted him nude photos. Allegedly. Although upon looking into the relationship of Kim and Kanye, they had known each other for much longer. Kim and Kanye go back as far as 2003 when they met on the set of Brandy's music video. That doesn't excuse what they did, but I see how they eventually kind of found their way back to each other. And who knows? Now they might be the president and the first lady. We don't know. Who knows? All from an entanglement. In at number two, Jada Pinkett Smith and August Alcina. Introducing the queen of entanglements, the first celeb that used the word as a way to describe an affair that she had with a family friend. Jada Pinkett Smith confirmed she was romantically involved with singer August Alcina during an episode for her Facebook watch show called Red Table Talk. She spoke openly about this while sitting across from her husband, Will Smith. The thing that really baffled people was that she did this with her son's friend. Jaden is the one that introduced August to the house and then he went and got himself entangled with his friend's mom? Come on, man. That is so greasy. And during the one-on-one -on -one interview with Will, Jada explained that her and August had become good friends, but I guess he missed the memo on keeping things hush-hush. August came out and claimed that he and Jada had started a relationship while she was married and Will had given him permission, which is completely false and only blew this thing up in the press even more. The couple also revealed in their conversation that they had briefly separated when Jada began seeing August, but with that behind them, they are apparently now committed to one another. Last but certainly not least in our number one spot, Britney Spears and Kevin Federline. Now brace yourselves for the worst case scenario of all entanglements, getting entangled with Kevin Federline. No, 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 that's, that's not it. But he definitely didn't make it any better. Kevin Federline was with his partner, Char Jackson, who was pregnant with their second child when he met Britney Spears. Months into the affair, Britney and Kevin were suddenly engaged. And the new celebrity couple was only married for two years and it all ended in a very, very, very messy divorce and custody battle. You know, the one where Britney ended up shaving her head. You know the one. With that, let's check out some of your comments from the video titled Top 10 TikTok Stars Who Destroyed Their Careers in 2020. Rusty Ann Yackel says, Grandma says, all hail the Bacon King. Johnny, good job as always. I love that you watch my videos with your grandma. Tell her the Bacon King gives his regards. Eric says, TikTok gone get banned. They career for sure done, I guess. You don't have a... You, I don't know where you stand on this. For sure, Trump is going to wipe out all of their careers with the swipe of a pen. I know that much. I don't know what that comment was about, though. Susan Johnson says, why aren't you putting their talents here? What talents? Lip syncing? 
Renegade, Renegade. Uh, we don't get copyright strike for that. Natty J says, don't know if you realize, but you talk super fast. You have a good voice and presentation, but need to slow down just a fraction. I never was good at fractions. I realize I talk fast and need to slow down, but at the same time, I got a lot to say. Jade Carey says, geez, this host talks in one big breath. It's quite the talent, I know. I'm going to the Olympics soon. And that has been the Top 10 Celebrity Entanglements. Thank you so much for watching and thank you to our editors for all of your hard work. If you enjoyed this video, then please show us some love here by tapping that like and subscribe button. Plus, don't forget to leave us a comment down below with your thoughts on today's list. And for more videos like this one, all you gotta do is tap that playlist when it pops up. From Top 10 Beyond the Screen, my name is Johnny Rogers saying until next time, stay classy.